Hey, this is Nellie's Farm. It's Sunday, November 17th, 2024. Got an emergency alert. Uh, <clears throat> I was thinking about doing a video earlier today. Kind of tired today. and uh, But um, <clears throat> I just read something that was kind of disturbing, so I thought I better go ahead and do it. Biden, according to the New York Times and other legit resource or sources sorry the the dogs are distracting me parking every time i turn this on it never fails they are um uh, biden he he gave permission for ukraine to use u.s made missiles to strike deep inside of russia now this is a red line i've mentioned this several times and i'll be the first to say that a lot of red lines have been crossed that putin warned about yeah, but we, we pushed and pushed and we crossed and not a whole lot happened. Now, you know that American troops are fighting directly Russians, right? This is not in the news. It won't be. There, You know, the Ukraine soldiers were depleted a long time ago. So, um, yes, American soldiers are fighting and dying over there. It's just not being reported, which is really strange. Like World War II, you know, it was all on the radio. Everybody gathered around the radio for updates. You know, um, it's different now. It's like life goes on. That Everybody's looking at the Mike Tyson fight, which was probably staged like everything else. Scripted. Um, you know, sports. Um, you know, election crap. Which I don't believe is over yet, by the way. Did you know that yesterday California reported that actually Democrats ended up winning California? Remember they said that it was uh, it was Republicans? <coughs> Excuse me. Well, now they said they just counted thousands and thousands more that weren't counted uh, votes, ballots. And so I'm wondering if this is going to spread and they're going to try to take the presidency away from Trump and that's how they will get their civil war. I don't think this election stuff's over. I have a, a funny feeling about it, guys. It's just too quiet, and it was too easy. I think that they've got something up their sleeve, and they will piss people off in a big way. So anyway, I wanted to report this. Now, yesterday, um, <clears throat> or probably the day before an American time, Russia, um, Russia <clears throat> took out some energy, tried to take out Ukraine's energy grid, western Ukraine and the Polish-Romanian border. I'm not that good at geography, guys. Please bear with me. And uh, my son is the Rick. He, oh, he's a, well, let's just say he's a genius. But anyway, um, that's one of my weak points is geography. But western Ukraine, um, we, uh, America, NATO, I should say, which is America, of course, they scrambled all kinds of jets, pretty much everything available from Poland and Romania in response to that huge attack. They used ballistic missiles, Russia did. They used cruise missiles trying to take Ukraine power grid down, okay? Which they did a lot of damage, but they said they don't know the details yet. So anyway, it is escalating despite red lines being crossed for a while now, you know. Um, a lot of people say, oh, well, you know, we're not paying attention anymore because nothing ever happens. I've heard that so many times, especially on GLP, for you GLPers. And by the way, um, I got access again. Who knows how long? <laughs> but um, anyway, I just want to do a quick update. Um, that's a big red line, U.S. missiles deep in Russia. I mean, come on. They've already taken like a few hundred cities and in Russia. Who ever would have thought that Americans would be invading Russian territory? Without nukes and stuff going off, you know? That's why I think a lot of this is just orchestrated to you. Sometimes I think maybe they are all on one side. But anyway, that's just my thoughts. It's so crazy now. It's so hard to get to the truth, and I try to do it on a daily basis. But I, I wanted to give you this update. I hope I didn't go on too long. I'm cooking for my sons and for the dogs, so I gotta go. And I hope you guys <laughs> have had a great weekend. And Nellie's Farm signing off. Thanks for watching. Love you guys.